YouTube, this is Coop the I Helper here, and today I have to make this video really quickly. It's going to be a review of that new iPhone OS 3.0 software update. I currently have an iPod Touch t second generation, so I'm still going to go over some of the iPhone updates, but I'm going to only be demonstrating for the iPod Touch ones because that's all I can do. And I have to kind of make this video as fast as possible because I only have 10 minutes. That's stupid rule YouTube made up. But let's go. Um, we're going to talk about first about cut, copy, and paste that um, Apple the emails flooded about this and they were able to get it. So, first, I'm going to, you can do this application, you can do this from application to application, any application. The way you do it is by holding down until you get the magnifying glass. When you get a magnifying glass, let go, click select, select, you can do it manually or select all. You can do it, um, it'll just click all the text. Um, do that again, select all, pick all the text, and then you'll get this thing where it says copy. You click copy, which is right there, bam. And then you could paste this now anywhere. For view purposes, I'll paste it into my mail application. Just to show you guys, so we'll compose a message, and I'm going to paste that by holding down and pasting. Now, everything that you saw in the notes application is now in my mail application that's another really cool it's another cool feature another thing I want to show you guys in this update is a landscape keyboard if you're someone like me who um is that doesn't have big fingers but accuracy is horrible on this keyboard so as you see here all you're gonna have to do is rotate it into landscape mode and it automatically adjusts now so you can type much better and easier and faster now you can do that um, you can do that landscape keyboard thing you can um, do that in mail the mail application you could do it when you text messaging mess all your messaging applications and you could do it in notes and in Safari of course so that's a, a major update you can also send MMS messages on the iPhone but AT&T doesn't current currently does not support that Hopefully they will soon. So, but if you're running a different carrier that does support MMS, you'll be able to MMS message because the iPhone supports it. Next is Spotlight Search. Spotlight Search is you have to be on the first page and you swipe to the right or you can just click the home button. And what that does is Spotlight Search, it finds what you're looking for across your whole phone or iPod all in one place. It searches through for your contacts, email, calendars, notes, as well as everything in your iPod. So let's say I was searching for an application. Let's say I was searching for Tweety. I just type it in in here and it found it. And if I clicked it, it would find the application and it would go to the application. Now I could do that for, um, as I said, I could do that same thing for contacts. If I was typing in the contact, I could find contact. I could do that for my email, go through all my emails up, up into the trash, into the spam folders, um, calendars, and your notes application. So that's a really nifty application to have. Next application I'm going to go over is Voice Memos. This is the new application that they put into the um, OS, which is currently right there. And this, you could update yourself on some things. I currently didn't bring my headset for my um, iPod, so but I already have a, a previously recorded one that I'll show you that the clarity. Just listen to how clear it is. I'm going to tell you when I hit when I hit play on this. Alright, I'm hitting it now. Do not forget to do the laundry this afternoon. I mean, I'm sorry, do not forget to do the laundry so I can go hang out this afternoon. Do not forget to do the laundry so I can hang out this afternoon. I hope you guys heard that. If you heard that, it's very clear and it's very easy to understand. So that's always going to be a nice application for me to have. Next is the iTunes Store. In the iTunes store now, you can actually download movies, music videos, TV shows, audiobooks, all from the iTunes store. As you see here, you can download movies, TV shows, and music videos. I currently, I downloaded Gran Torino, I actually rented it. It was a great movie, and it went straight to my thing. I didn't even have to plug it up to my computer or anything. I watched it, and it went right away. Um, you also have audiobooks you can download in iTunes U. You could actually log into your iTunes account and manage your account from the iTunes application. Next thing I'll show you is the stocks application. 
regularly you're used to seeing it like this but now in 3.0 you can turn it into landscape and in landscape you get a, a more glance of information you can view the charts in landscape mode so you just obviously turn it like this bam you got yourself a nice detailed enhanced chart and you could flow through your chart like this just like you flick through your cover flow so it's a nice enhancement very nice enhancement and it's very very clear for you guys who need that um sorry my camera uh next the next few applications i mean not applications updates on the os is um a minor ones and i'm just gonna go over them briefly next thing is some safari improvements um when i say safari improvements i mean like i'm sorry let me get out of here um let's say i wanted to go to um gmail let's see type it in right here g gmail dot com okay I'm typing in gmail dot com here let me see this when I t click that you might see some another feature up here called autofill that will automatically fill in um let's say your usernames and passwords and it could do many more so that's autofill It'll automatically fill that type of stuff in that's a great enhancement next thing that they have on only on the iPhone is um internet tethering so what you could basically do is you can share your internet connection with your laptop with internet tethering via bluetooth or usb cable now that's only for the iphone and the at&t does not currently support that the only way you can use that is if you had an other carrier rather than at&t and they happen to support it you got stereo bluetooth you can also now synchronize your notes your notes from your notes application you can sync it um all your notes right on your um right from your iPhone onto your Mac or your PC so that should be handy iTunes store obviously you can manage and view your account YouTube is great is a great application now Be not because now you could log into your account you could view your subscriptions you could comment on a video right from this application you could view someone's channel it's it's really great now I'm going to you can save and sync bookmarks and rate favorites right from this application and it'll go into your YouTube account. So I'm going to find myself using this application much more than I used to. Um, which is really cool. Next is a, it's something really cool that's only, it was only out on the Nano. It was the shake thing. You would see people do it. Say I was listening to, I don't know, this song. Um, by Little Wayne, and I didn't want to listen to it anymore. I want to change it. All I do is shake it, and it changes the sound. So that's really cool. So that's that's something really cool, guys. You could shake to shuffle. Um, it picks any song from your music library. It'll just shuffle it. Um, the next thing is you guys should get the latest applications for the next generation, which was 3.0. So you have like peer to peer games and many more things and app purchases. You guys should really check out 3.0. Um, as you guys see, there's 113 different, um, things, updates. I, I obviously can go over everything in this video. So, um, I, all my friends on YouTube, if you friend requested me, I sent this out to them all these 113 things if you haven't received one please uh, message me if you want one I'll see I'll try to get one to you as fast as possible so I can show you all these 113 updates but YouTube have a great day don't forget to rate comment and subscribe please recommend me to your friends call me on Skype Coop that helper follow me on Twitter Coop that helper and um, please sign up for Swagbucks using my referral link all that stuff will be in the video description over on that side don't forget Hit the subscribe button. Peace. It's cool. Die helper.